how to track the factors on your transit lines hello everybody welcome to another tutorial in this video you'll learn how you can track the patches on your transit line so while using the transit app you can always trans you can always track the patches easily and here is how to go about it the first step is to um ensure that you have transit app installed on your device and then once you have it installed just click on it and then you you'll be brought to the home page automatically so once you're on this home page as you can see on my screen at the top part there is a write-up which says you are in an unsupported region this means that where i'm located currently there are some features that will not be available to me okay but just follow through as i explain how you go about it now for, for you if you are in a region that's supported by transit application after opening the transit app you'll be brought some the home screen where you see a map so on this map you would see two pulsating waves next to the countdown for a departure okay because once you're on the map you would see um transit lines you would see departure you'll see um different things on the application that is related to your trip okay so just look for the two pulsating waves that are next to the countdown for a departure these waves indicate the real-time information okay and then if these waves are not present like mine here the times in the app will be grayed out showing the posted schedule without reflecting any delays or service um changes so once you can see this um transit displays real-time arrivals by tracking the life locations of transit vehicles on the map so the top right corner of the vehicle icon indicates if there are riders on board or shows the last update time for that video's location so for you to be able to identify the departure time for the, um, the positing waves next to a departure indicates read time information okay and then grade out departure time show the scheduled times and if a trip is cancelled the lines will be grayed out and crossed out this is how you can know because each of the waves or the lines represent different things so this is how you can track them when you see pulsating waves that means that that's the real time departure for grade out waves you would see that means that um the departure is being scheduled and then if a trip is cancelled the lines would be grayed out and crossed and if a trip is likely to be cancelled um transit transit will analyze the data to determine if it's likely cancelled so this is basically how you can just track it so you can track departure by following through these waves by checking out the one that is positing by checking out the cancelled lines by looking at if it's grayed out and, and crossed and all of this through all of this you'll be able to track the patches now one thing you must also know as a customer of the transit app is that transit agencies use gps trackers in buses and trains to monitor vehicle positions all right so based on the actual location agencies calculate more precise arrival times so this real time arrival updates are sent to transit and displayed in the app so you have no need to worry okay so this is how it works thanks for watching and have a good day